Hey, what's up guys, it's John, or Mongo, whatever you want to call me. Um, so today I want to talk to you guys about something that's it's a little different. Sorry for the voice, I have a cold right now. Uh, but I want to talk to you guys about a sensitive topic. And it's going to involve the channel. Um, you, you may not want to watch. Uh, there's going to be some changes coming to the channel. But the topic that I want to talk to you guys about that's sensitive is veteran suicide. And so if that's something that, that you don't want to hear, um, you know, go ahead and click out right now. Uh, it's not going to upset me. And um, other than that, let's, let's talk, guys, because I deal with this all the time. You see this little girl right here? She's going away for a while. Okay, here's the deal, guys. Um, I might lose some of you guys as subscribers because... I'm leaving for a while. Guys, you know, if you've been with the channel for a while, you know that uh, that I was a veteran, I did 25 years, did seven combat deployments, um, and I deal with PTSD and depression and anxiety and suicidal thoughts all the time. Um, medically retired, you know, disabled vet. I'm not 100% disabled. Uh, I lied to the VA about how often I have suicidal thoughts. Um, I lied to them about some other medical conditions because I didn't want to be a 100% disabled vet. So I hid some things. I'm still hiding some things, whatever. Um, but yes, I am a disabled vet. I deal with this stuff all the time with, with PTSD, suicide, depression. And uh, it is what it is. So, YouTube for me was something just for a, a way for me to like document my stuff and, and have fun with it, right? I never wanted to get big, I never wanted to grow and get huge because I don't like the recognition. It kind of weirds me out. When people come up to me and say hi, it kind of weirds me out. And so, you know, it's kind of counterproductive to put out YouTube videos and ask people to subscribe and share and all that stuff and then deep down you're like man it weirds you out when people do it um and so i've talked to you know some of you guys uh that i know personally we've had this, this these discussions before and uh and again it's sort of that self-preservation thing with you know my personality and you know i just don't like recognition but <clears throat> so a couple weeks ago um a couple months ago, I took a vacation, went to Arizona, and uh, I was doing a lot of hiking while I was out there. And of course, I was filming everything because, um, you know, Alex Rudd once told me that everything you do is content, film it. And so I decided, you know, I'm out here hiking, I'll film it. And so I filmed this stuff, and I never put it out to you guys because I was like, you guys are a fishing channel in Arkansas. Like, no one's gonna care about me going for hikes in Arizona. None of you guys are gonna care about that. You don't give a shit. Um, but it was kind of therapeutic for me to do these hikes, right? It kind of helped me with with uh, with my PTSD and it, 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 it felt great. And so, I don't know, two weeks ago, I was talking to Derek Dixon and a few others at Grand Lake for the BFL Regional. And, um, and I told him what was going on you know, he knows the story, the, and not many people know the whole entire story, but I'm, you know, um, but I told him what was going on and that I made these videos and that, uh, you know, it was helping me with my PTSD doing these hikes and stuff. And, and I just don't know if I should put the videos out or whatever. And Derek said, he's like, yeah, dude, put it out because, um, you know, your subscribers are either going to watch it or they're not but you might pick up a whole nother group of subscribers uh, and you might actually help somebody who's going through the same sort of thing. And so I decided I'd put these videos out. So there's gonna be some hiking videos coming out, guys. And that's cause, you know, I listen to Derek. Maybe this will help somebody. Um, and because of that, it got me thinking, I'm gonna open up a lot more. I'm gonna open up a lot more about my struggles with PTSD and depression and suicide and stuff like that. I, I hide it from you guys on the channel, um, but I struggle with it on a daily basis. And so I'm gonna start opening up a little more and showing maybe, maybe 
showing a little more of my personal life um, and just trying to to be more of me and let you guys um, you know let you guys in because maybe it'll help someone else who's struggling also so with that said guys if you're still watching which I'm sure most of you guys have already probably clicked off if you're still watching drop a comment right now and, and uh, you know say something uh, but if you're still watching here's the deal this is November 2nd. I've had a headache since May 28th. Last year I had one for eight months straight. Um, this, this year, I don't know how many months it's been since May 28th, but it's November 2nd, still have this headache. Um, when I was in Arizona, the headache felt a lot better. And, uh, and there's some other health issues that I'm dealing with. <clears throat> and so at the end of November, I'm leaving. And I'm going to Arizona for a few months and so there's going to be more hiking videos there might be some trout fishing there might be some bass fishing I have no idea what I'm going to be filming I'm just probably going to open up a little more on my life um, I'm not taking the wife and kids they're staying here uh, I'm not taking the boat I'm just taking some stuff I'm going to go stay with a friend we're going to do hikes and whatever else we can do to, I don't know, keep ourselves entertained on the weekends. I, I have no idea. I don't know. We're going to do some hikes and, and stuff, um, maybe fishing. I don't know. I have no idea. But I'm taking this because I need to heal uh, with some, some health issues that I got to take care of over there. And uh, Arkansas is not conducive for what I have to take care of. Um, so that's that. I'll be back in January for some sponsor obligations. So I have to come back in January one way or another. Uh, and then I'll de determine, depending on how things are going, what the future holds, if I'm going to stay here in Arkansas or if I'm going to go back. Or I think I'm going to go back. I think I'm just going to come back here to Arkansas for a little bit, you know, for these sponsor obligations and then turn around and head back to Arizona. I want to give Arizona at least six months, I think. <laughs> just to that should give me enough time to to get everything fixed I hope um, but yeah that's that guys so that's gonna be my new journey <clears throat> uh, not much for tournament fishing right now that I, I don't foresee much for tournament fishing next year because I don't know what, what I'm gonna be doing um, hopefully you guys still stay with the channel and and uh, share it and, and do help me grow because again if this if I'm willing to open up about this stuff then it has potential to help some other people so help me grow let's get this channel huge I guess and uh, you know whatever again guys thank you very much for watching if you're new to the channel hit the subscribe button um, you guys been with me for a while thank you guys very much for your support and your continued support and uh, it's gonna be trying I don't know what we're going to do, but we'll figure it out. Anyway, guys, as always, get on the water, be safe, and go stick some lips.